Welcome, society members. We are excited to invite you to the Inhuman Patreon campaign. Definitely want to start with the Apache remix thing. Um, let's go here. This should be good now. And I would say let's start right away. Um, Apache Witch Nightpunk remix. Um, broken remix. So it's 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 a special one. Special remix. Broken remix. Maybe there's a fixed one later. We will see. <laughs> Honestly, I have to say the I Killed the Orchestra EP was a tiny letdown for me compared to the album he released. But that's just me. Nice sub here. Alright. Classic night punk style, right? Let's see. Oh, that's dope. Camjax, hello, back to Italy. Classic night punk here. Pretty damn dope. Not a lot to complain. The production is really, really good. Um, feel you. It's a breakbeat. It's a breakbeat remix. That's why it's called Broken Remix. A solid max. Paul, 100%. Breakbeat is nuts. Uh, the prodigy, pioneers of breakbeat, if you want. Yeah, that's pretty dope. That's pretty damn dope. I like it a lot. I'm. I think the vocals are cool. Gives me Ice Peak vibes. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of the distorted vocals here, but they still add something to it. So I, I can absolutely enjoy this one. Um, production is. So dope, really, really well made. Um, pretty damn sick. Nice. Uh, next up is the Born Dirty remix from Witch again. 
again, I have to criticize having more than one remixes of one song. Um, it just makes it always a bit tiring to listen to these compilations, in my opinion. <laughs> And a boring intro. Hey, energetic. The kick sounds so bad, holy shit. This could be pretty powerful, but they decided to cut the low end out of the kick. This is not hitting anywhere. Max, thank you so much. Uh, Trey Ray is kind of eliminate from Wish, right? Uh, this is born dirty. Lips designs, thank you for the follow. Yeah, this is not hitting. I think the biggest problem here are the really, really weak drums. Everything else is kind of fine and, and got like a funny bouncy feeling to it, but the, the drums are a bit meh. Glips only the Night Punk remix yet. I just started, so welcome. Yeah, that that was not really for me. Let's go to the next one. Time Warp Level Up remix. I think I heard a live video of this one. Um, first of all, shout out to Level Up. She's seems really really nice. Um, makes big moves, and I love that she's actually producing, um, even though some people at the beginning thought that Subtronics helps her and stuff. And obviously she learns from him, but you can also see that um, she's doing her own stuff and that's lovely. Hey, Wicked Nick, what's good, man? Solid intro. Get 
gotta say, it's not my style. Definitely not. It's well done, though. I think the snare could be different. Um, the snare has like this really sound I don't really like. Um, so I, I would kind of change that. And I think the chords would be a bit thicker. There's like a nice little plugin called Blur in Bitwig um, that can make these kind of thinner chords a bit thicker because it duplicates the chords with a delay. Um, so that could be a thing that helps here, but otherwise I think the direction and the idea is pretty cool. And again, I love to see that she's just, uh, yeah, doing her own stuff and not, not using the, the position she's in, if you want. It's pretty cool. Julian, thank you for the follow. I think like two years or something, Paul. And at least she got heavy drums. <laughs> I mean, you can definitely hear that she has a feeling for music, right? And that's dope. This melody is nice. Yeah, Max, absolutely. There's some cool melodic stuff going on. Um, biggest problem for me here is the snare, I think. Actually, the snare is just like really, really dubstep-ish and I would love to hear like a more creative, interesting snare here. Otherwise, this is damn decent. Pretty cool. Dude, does Twitch, what's up, man? Um, all right. Now we got the Tom Finster remix of Time Warp. I think Tom Finster is like a more orchestral producer. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, definitely more today. The remixes are pretty short. It does not seem like Tom Finster is an orchestral artist. I was wrong. On bass. Oh, damn vibes. That's unique, dude. the writing on this one holy shit like this little bass step dun, dun, dun. so nice
Making me work in the morning Taking my time, you just own me Getting tired of this kiss ceremony Night, are you here for a moment? Making me work in the morning Taking my time, you just own me Getting tired of this kiss ceremony This is so far the the best produced one and written one in my opinion. Um, everything works together. So many elements, nice melody, uh, melody, melodicity. I wanted to say, um, extremely well done. Not one hundred percent my vibe. I gotta say, it's just a bit too too soft for me for drum bass, if you want. But it's incredibly enjoyable. Damn. I got you, Paul. Thank you. <laughs> that pause, dude. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Cheers, Luke. <laughs> Oh, damn, this drop. Wow, okay. I love how the instruments are kind of merging into each other and morphing around. That's really fucking dope. Ouija, you will see. That was pretty damn sick. All right, never change Sullivan King remix. Interesting. Yeah, Max, 100%. Great idea. Is the original with Sullivan King, maybe? That would be kind of cool. Pesci, uh, I'm not sure. No. Oh, that was the call-up with Emir. Ah, that makes sense. Okay, nice. Not a fan of the high vocals here. Eclipse, yeah, I heard it back in the days, but I don't remember too much of it. Because I didn't like the EP that much. Drums here sound kind of weak again. Build up after build up though.
Oh, yes, dude. Fucking Sullivan King Electro, man. That's fucking dope. Interval votes good, my dude. That's legit fucking sick. How do you even live knowing we're through that we're not If I can't have my freedom, neither should you. You're not a Nice. Dude, he really went in on this one. That might be my favorite Sullivan King tune yet. Damn. <laughs> Let's go, dude. It works. It works. Let's go, dude. Sullivan King, that was fucking dope. Um, my favorite remix and song of yours, I think. Really damn cool. Holy shit. Did not expect that. That was different. Love it. Next up, we got Never Changed, the Caracal Project remix. Caracal Project. Top-notch producers. Producer? I don't know. Uh, Angel MNK, thank you for the follow. Let's see what this one is about. How to live since we fell through I dream of you Buried deep in the feelings I hold on to I can't let loose You break my heart Oh, I'm not a fan of this one I don't like the sound I really don't like this. Maybe of noisier, Paul. <laughs> I 
I kind of expected something different. <laughs> that sound was cool. Okay, now it's getting weird. Okay, okay, okay. Atonal shit. Okay, I like that. How do you even live? It, it's weird as fuck, I gotta say that. No. A flopper I did, yeah. Privately. And I only like one song. That we will not do. If I can't have my freedom, neither should you. You're not immune. So what am I? Okay, I like that. They do some weird shit and I can appreciate that for sure. I didn't like the first drop at all, but it's it's kind of growing on me because of the weirdness that's happening. That, that, that's what I mean. The sound design, there's like some little details that really catch me. That's pretty damn dope, right? I really don't like this sound though. Yeah, Angel, I get that, yeah. Yeah, not for me. Not for me, well done, but not for me. Never change acoustic version. I think I will skip this one, um, because I know it already. I heard this one, I really enjoy it. Um, it's not too interesting for the stream, though. So let's get to more, more, more FN Remix. For drums. It's so shifted. The build-up was lackluster as fuck, right? So I like the melodicity and the drop, and the sound design is cool as well. Big problem is the sound design and the mix down is kind of weird. I don't know. It's catchy. But it feels not finished. It really feels not finished. Like, you know, at least make it in, in the metro, like in the break after the drop, at least copy the sub bass if you use the same one. Just render it, copy it, freeze it, whatever, and tone it down a bit. Just just reduce the volume a bit, because like this, it, it just sounds unfinished. 
After the drop, it turns into something that sounds like a drop because the sub is that hard, but it feels disconnected because there's not that much energy like in the drop, obviously. You know, the, the sub here is extremely overpowering because everything else is from the intro, which is less loud, obviously. Same X. Yeah, honestly, not a fan of this one. I was kind of expecting Evans like signature style and was waiting for it and it it did not appear it's kind of a bit of a letdown because I really like Evans stuff Three times the same drop. That's creativity. Yeah, I don't know. Um, kind of, kind of sounds weird. Um, not for me. Not for me. I think there, there's a lot of potential here. Um, it's really catchy. Like uh, the melody in this one is pretty dope. The vocals work pretty well, and everything works pretty well. But it feels not fleshed out. It feels unfinished and rushed, in my opinion. Um, besides that, cool remix, but not for me at all. More, more, more. Sally remix. Let's go. So uh, interval seems like that, yeah. I dreamt I would make them all see what I could be. I do it with music that came from my soul. I tried and I a flopper or something after it for sure. Felt like a bird with no feathers. The winter was cooling and so was the weather. I posted a joke in the dead of December and put myself on like your favorite sweater. I did it again just to prove I could do it. Uh, interval it's sadly too long for the stream i would love though maybe i would dedicate a stream to it oh the intro is boring Nice Reese. That's cool. It's nothing new, but it's well done.
Nice, dude. That's cool. <laughs> That's my favorite part so far. Oh, damn, dude. Love the doom snare. Uh, also, Max, I think it's dubstep. It's decent. Pretty nice. Um, kind of. It it feels like yeah we have to make a dubstep remix for the for this release, but honestly it's well done. Uh, sound design is okay. Mix down needs work. It's it's a bit noisy at times, and sometimes you don't really hear the sound design because of all the shit that's going on. Uh, drums are pretty cool actually. Um, I like the metro, like this um, yeah, more more trap oriented part. And in general, it's pretty well done. Pretty cool remix. Nice. And that's it. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, that's it.